Mayhem in Midtown. Video shows a minivan hitting a group of women, other cars, and even a tree during a chaotic scene that played out in front of a group of neighbors. So I'm like, you come to somebody's house, their kids is in the house crying, you running them over. So this woman is steady in the van, backing over people, putting it in reverse, backing it up, putting it in drive, backing it up. She's totally cognizant of her action. That scene played out for more than 10 minutes before officers arrived, arresting the driver of that minivan. Three women were hit by the van. Fortunately, all three women are expected to be okay. It happened around 5.30 this afternoon in the area of Peterborough and 4th Street. Larry Spruill is there live. And Larry, what are neighbors there telling you tonight? Yeah, Kimberly and, and Karen, neighbors here tell us that they are just really surprised and shocked that all of this happened here at this intersection. Now, police say the white driver, the white female driver, ran over three women with her car, and it was all caught on cell phone video. That's the white lady from earlier yeah. who we drove past. Local four on the scene of 4th Street in Peterborough Friday night. We obtained this cell phone video from Rachel Smith. Smith, one of the many witnesses who saw this blue minivan run over three of her neighbors. <laughs> the Detroit police said the 44 year old white female suspect was driving a blue 2002 Dodge Caravan when she hit three females with her car. They were 23, 28 and 34 years old. Two of the girls who she ran over, two of the black girls, they were bloody because she actually hit them. And we're like, what? Moments later, you can see the girl in the pink who was ran over earlier running behind the woman in the van with the bat. Neighbors say the victim was trying to get the driver to stop. Police say that's when she struck other vehicles in the area and a tree. Oh my God. Oh my she God. ran over the side. So this woman is steady in the van, backing over people, putting it in reverse, backing it up, putting it in drive, backing it up. She's totally cognizant of her actions. I don't know what transpired between when I saw her under the tree and when I saw her trying to run them over, but all I know is you don't get to run people over no matter what happens. That's illegal. Hey, first of all, it's Juneteenth. Like, this is the day black folks got emancipated. If you're going to respect black people any time of the year, it should be Juneteenth. And police say that driver is in the hospital in serious condition. Meanwhile, the three victims, they are in stable condition. We're live in Midtown tonight. Larry Spruill, Local 4. So, Larry, at the beginning of the video, we hear somebody say that's the lady from earlier who we drove past. What, what is she exactly talking about? And do we know what started this all? And Kimberly, really, that's what we're trying to figure out. Now, neighbors say they don't know how or why this started, but they did see the driver sitting at the corner of a store just really up the road from here earlier this afternoon. Police are trying to figure all of this out. This case and this accident is under investigation. Kimberly. Yeah, incredible video there. Okay, Larry, thanks.